It is pressure cooker time in the Champions League. Four teams are left and the stage is set for an enthralling semi-final. Who will make it through to the showpiece event? It's Leipzig. They take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. Good evening to you from a city that has become one of Germany's most visited in recent years. We're in Leipzig. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And we're getting down to the wire in the UEFA Champions League. Tonight, the first leg of the semi-final coming right up. It's RB Leipzig, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. Let's hope it lives up to its billing. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two balls who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. Cutting it back. Nicely saved. Well, he took care of it defensively. Mendy. Options in the middle. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Kepa begins in goal. David Alaba plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Well, a foul, but no yellow card at this early stage in the opinion of the referee. Well, he might just be lucky it's so early on. He'll have to be careful now. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, three goals in the last three games. He's in great form at the moment. He's playing with confidence as well. Every chance he could add to that tally today. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Across from Danny Cabajal. And smuggled behind for the corner. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. Well, did his job defensively. And foiled by the post. What can Real do from this position? Chance to put them in front. And a goal! The opening statement in this semi-final. How important could that prove to be? Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Well, he can't control his delight, can he? It's a wonderful moment for his team. And the ball is moving again. So having conceded, let's find out if Leipzig can flick a switch and come up with a goal of their own. Mohamed Simakon. And a tidy tackle. And Bellingham. Could be. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. Well, just look at this piece of skill. He times this absolutely perfectly. Great connection as well. We'll see this for years to come. Fantastic goal. So, 2-0 now. Openda. Benjamin Henrichs. Leipzig moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Oh, 
And passing it through. And he's in the clear. And he's up. And still an opportunity. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. And the keeper there to deal with it. So the corner played into the box and hit with ferocity. It was close, but not quite good enough. David Alaba. Mendy has it. Attacking possibilities for Real. But they took care of the situation defensively. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Simons. Paulsen. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. take a free kick but no goal in the end well he's such a threat from set plays and you just saw why that was such a good effort Federico Valverde here's Carvajal and Bellingham Oh, great vision. Could cross it in here. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Simons. Envies. Could run very much in control of the situation. Could reduce the deficit. Schlager. Now with Forsberg. And what a magical save it was! Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Delivering it. Forsberg. And to reduce the deficit. It could be up for grabs. And able to get a body in the way. Can't get the shot through. Vinicius Junior. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. No nonsense clearance. Valverde. Tony Kroos. Aurelien Chouameni. Just narrowly off target. Raum. That is how to apply the pressure. And we are going to have two additional minutes. David Raum. Vinicius. It's there for him. And the keeper more than equal to it. Oh, 
Ross with the corner. And that is going to do it. That is going to be all for the first half here in Leipzig. Well, there aren't too many players quite like Vinicius Junior. And I know you've enjoyed his performance up to this point, Stuart. Well, his skill level to go past defenders and get shots away has been excellent today. The only surprise, he's just got the one goal. And off and running again. There was a real golf in class in the first 45. Will we see an improved effort from Leipzig in the second? Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. And Leipzig in a position of menace. Delivered into the box. Well, a bit short with the clearance. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. And threading it through. And he's made the run. Good ball played over. What a lovely strike. Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, there's a man who knows his team have been really good today. Just what Ancelotti would have wanted. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Well, strong play here. He's in with a chance. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Mendy. This is Kroos. Bellingham. Carvajal. Showing a real will to win the ball. This is a message for all away supporters. Cross has support. Mendy not messing around with that clearance. Rudiger. That's a well struck pass. And Bellingham. On to Carvajal. Keeping the ball moving. Huge block. Just the challenge that was required. Pressure applied. And a throw coming up after that authoritative challenge. And time for the change now. to Rome on the wing for Leipzig could play it in really being closed down Rudiger now with Bellingham Mendy And now here's Henrichs. Amadou Haidara. Paulsen. Determined defending. Rodrigo. A 
Raum. But wasteful from Leipzig. Twenty minutes to go. Rudiger. David Alaba. Mendy. Tony Kroos. Here's Valverde. Well, high marks for that pass. Well, it's a very attractive passing sequence. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. by Kroos still not clear took a rip oh off the post still alive well it came to nothing in the end Schlager shielding the ball superbly oh but they've lost it now Rodrigo now with Mendy well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Just ten minutes to go. And Leipzig with the ball again. Werner. Clean challenge. Good thing from his point of view. Mendy. Chouameni. Well, keeping the ball as they're doing is helping the cause. Vinicius Junior. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Vinicius! There it is! Victory more or less guaranteed now! Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. If there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Simmons. Leipzig with acres of space out wide. Schlager. Aydara. Closing down well. And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, here's the replay. The little one-two starts everything off. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. The current scoreline, 4-2. Tony Kors. Now with Bellingham. We will have three minutes of additional time at the end here. Space for Real out wide. Happy to take on the shot.
Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. And there it is, the full-time whistle. It's advantage, Real Madrid going into the return leg. Well, they were really good today. Their approach play, their movement off the ball, and of course their finishing were excellent, as was their work rate. A disciplined performance in the second leg, and they're into the final. We simply have to focus on this man. Well, Derek, we know his movement is very clever, but it's that speed of that movement that causes defenders so many problems. He's got great pace, he gets 1v1 against the goalkeepers, and nobody can recover. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu, right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is the second leg of this Champions League semi-final. It's Real Madrid facing Hervé Leipzig. Well, Derek, Real showed just how good they were in that first leg. They were well organised, they played some great football and they took their chances. I just can't see how they lose this one. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Kepa is the goalkeeper. Fernand Mendy starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, a diamond in midfield can be a good system in a 4-4-2, but only if you know how to play it well. Yes, they should dominate the central areas, but they could be vulnerable out wide. Well, Jude Bellingham has become one of the finest all-around midfield players in world football. That's no exaggeration. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Well, no point in stopping play, advantage with them. But he's retrospectively awarded the free kick, having let it flow initially. They've given back possession easily. Paulsen. Haidara. Envies. Can he open the door to a potential goal? And it took a touch off the defender, so it will be a corner. <laughs> He's driven in the corner. Well, it has come to nothing. Real might threaten on the flank. And hit with ferocity! Well, good clean catch by the keeper. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Schlager. On to Forsberg. David Raum. Opportunity. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Oh, it's off the post! Oh, he could give it away.
Toni Kroos. Kroos! Well, it wasn't quite the quality of shot that we were all anticipating. Could be a chance to break here. Well, it broke down, alas. Vinicius Jr. Clearance needed to be better. Mendy. Ball played nicely. Tony Kroos. Now options are plenty. And let's give credit to the defending. Over the touchline for what will be a Real Madrid throw. Vinicius Jr. Oh, that's a fine save. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. He succeeds in clearing it. Carvajal. Crossing into the middle. Well, it still could be dangerous. And problem solved for now. Lukeba. And that's great work to keep it in play. Powerson. Nice weight on the pass. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. That's useful play. Carvajal. David Alaba. Aurelien Chouameni. Mendy. Played into the box, making sure nothing untoward happened. Doesn't want to lose his cool here. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Schlager Credit to them for winning back possession Federico Valverde David Alaba That can be so difficult to play against a confident passing team when you're trailing not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. Cross fired over, and a fine stop. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. So back underway here into the second half. <laughs> Tremendous intuition to win it back. 
Powerson. Good visualisation and execution. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. One nil then. Tony Kroos. Here's Carvajal. Aurelia Chouameni. Kroos. Mandy has it. Oh, could be an opportunity here. Just couldn't get it through. Well, pressing really high. And Kroos failed to hold it. Emil Forsberg. Haidara. Well, a good tackle. Clear foul play. And as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Here it is now, a substitution. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. Mendy. And Bellingham. Mendy. And a good looking ball. Struggling to get it away. Mendy. Across, lacking guile and accuracy. So, a Real Madrid corner. Who can he pick out? Emphasis on the clearance, a good one. And having a go! Well, an attempt almost from a different postcode and not very far away. Well, from that sort of range, that's a very decent effort. Losing possession. Now, who can he play it to? And playing it through. Paulson. Can he do it? Attempting to place the ball in the back of the net, but not going according to plan. Carvajal. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Will he play it in? And Bellingham, and a long way out. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Is it going to be? What a decisive punch by the keeper. Simons. David Raum. Well, a really good run. Crossing into the middle. And hit with ferocity. It was close, but not quite good enough. Madrid. 
substitution for Real Madrid. Mendy. 15 minutes left for play. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. A good vision there. And well positioned to clear. And the referee allowing the game to flow, using advantage. Well, he was very keen to give them the advantage, but instead it will be a free kick now. Ten minutes left for play. Oh, an incredible clearance! I must say, I didn't see that coming. And it goes! As they inch closer, can they grab another one? Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. So the ball rolling again. And 2 0. Mendy. Rodrigo. Mendy has it. Vinicius Jr. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Schlager. In possession, Yusuf Paulsen. And he read it well, intercepting it. But he's certainly not alone. Really sound defending. Still a chance. But no, it's not going to be an opportunity because the flag is up. And the substitution will occur now. Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here. Rodrigo. Well, fair play to him. He took it on, but off target in the end. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going can he take advantage and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save we'll score here and they're through could this be the set play that puts the tie to bed and in by Luka Modric and increasing the pressure another corner it is Oh, that's not a good clearance. Modric. Cross could be useful. Oh, but claimed by the goalkeeper. Vinicius Jr. And Valverde. And that's it. Official now. Real Madrid have made it to the final. Well, it wasn't the greatest performance, was it? Not sure they'll care. They did all the hard work in the first leg and they're in the final. And that's all that matters. They certainly will need to improve, though. They can't play like they did today and win the final.